it's Amy from Star Within Grace. Uh, this week coming I'm going to do the My Dad Chooses My Outfits for the Week Challenge. So I'd like to introduce you to my dad. Hi there. <laughs> I'm really excited about this challenge actually. I'm really intrigued as to what you're going to put me in. How would you describe my style? Well I think you're a bit sporty. Mm -hmm. You've got a, a, thin, a thin figure so you, you can show off a lot of stuff and I just I think I'll pick some nice clothes for you out of your your wardrobe. Okay, so how do you think you're going to go? Do you think I'm going to like what I, what you put me in? I think so. Okay. I think so. so but you, you're uh, confident? Yeah, I, I'm not sure about the colours, but um, I'll try. I'll do my best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you do great. I'm really excited to see what it's going to look like. I'm going to get my dad to go through the Stylebook app on my phone because um, that's where I have all the photos of the clothing pieces in my wardrobe and he can input each clothing piece into each day of the week. Um, so it's a full seven day week and I'll be working five days out of those seven days so I've told him to make sure to keep it work appropriate. Um, other than that he has complete free range of what he wants to put me in um, so each day like like obviously the full outfit but then also shoes, a handbag and maybe some jewellery or accessory of some kind. I think the jewellery I'll be a little bit uh, <laughs> sceptic about because I'm not so good on jewellery but I'll, I'll try and keep everything matched as what I would wear and, and sort of in the colours and, uh, and uh, not put you in pyjama pants and a t-shirt. <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> well that might be fun when you're at home not doing nothing. Yeah, uh, that's fine if I'm at home, that's fine. <laughs> All right. Hope you have a success with it. All right, great. Well, I'll get him to input all the clothing and then I will do a video diary each day um, showing you what he has put me in. You might all want a dad like me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why wouldn't they? <laughs>the outfits that my dad picked out for me. So today's outfit is um, my striped blue culotte type pants, plain back tee, some black sunnies, black ballet flats, my black leather jacket and some black stud earrings that are pretty plain. The first outfit my dad picked out actually had like pants that I'd worn last week. I was away all weekend visiting my parents so I didn't have time to do the washing like I normally did so I had to do that today. So I couldn't actually put my full outfit on until I finished washing the first load. So I was walking around without new pants on. <laughs> um, but I finally finished the first load so I finally got the full outfit with pants. <laughs> Um, don't mind all of the cat hair. That's what happens when you own a cute, white, fluffy cat. Um, so yeah, I actually quite like this outfit. Like, it is definitely something I would wear. It's like, basically the pants with all black accessories. Um, the sunnies, I don't tend to wear sunnies all that often. Just cause, like, I'm inside and it's really not necessary. Whenever I'm outside, I'm usually driving, so I have to wear my glasses. But I really love the look of Sunnies. I just, I never get to wear them, which is a pity. But I'm making a point of wearing them today, even though I'm inside. I, I did go out this morning. We did do the grocery shopping. So I got a bit of use out of them then, because I got Michael to drive. <laughs> so yeah, I'm pretty comfy. This is definitely something I would pick myself. Yeah, I can't really complain. It's like... Not too much of a challenge at all. Um, so I'm actually really hungry, so I'm thinking I'm going to make myself some lunch now. Look what a healthy lunch I'm eating. And that is purely because that is all that we have in the house. Now to watch some Chicago Med while I eat my lunch. Bye for now. Good morning everyone, it is day two and um, I've put my outfit on for today. Today my dad has put me in this bell sleeve top, a silver friends necklace on underneath that and paired it with my paisley patterned baggy pants with um, some black heeled sneakers. 
Uh, <laughs> it is definitely not something I would ever pair together. I'm feeling a little bit like frumpy in it. Like, it just. Yeah. <laughs> and these pants I would never wear to work, and I probably wouldn't pair them with the top or the the shoes and like even this top I wouldn't wear with a necklace typically because the neckline is pretty like high so it kind of just has to sit underneath the tie up which is kind of weird <laughs> yeah I don't even have any earrings on which is kind of strange it's like yeah I'm feeling quite uncomfortable in this outfit this is gonna be interesting going to work in this outfit I'm like going to feel kind of self-conscious. <laughs> I'm looking forward to tomorrow already because it's going to be better than this. I'm so sure. And I was like a holding judgment until I actually put it on because I was like, mm, maybe it'll look okay, but I don't like it. What can I say? <laughs> Sorry, Dad. This one is a fail. Good morning guys, it's day three. Um, my dad has picked a dress that I have not unpacked for the season yet. So I'm going to have to go rummaging through my suitcases to find it. Oh my gosh, I looked in every single suitcase it could possibly be in and I like couldn't find it. I was getting like seriously annoyed and then I go back to the first one that I looked in and here it is. Anyway, I'm going to change now. Okay, I'm all dressed now. Uh, definitely liking this one better than yesterday. <laughs> That's not hard though, I really wasn't feeling yesterday's outfit. It's just a nice thick peplum dress with my black leather jacket and some black heels. So it's a pretty classic outfit, can't really go too wrong. When we were talking to dad in the intro video, I asked him what style he thought I had and it was, I found it really interesting he said sporty because that's not exactly how I would define my style, like it's interesting but then I think of all of the casual gear that I normally wear when I go up to his place and I suppose it does have a sporty look to it. Uh, my office clothing doesn't look sporty because that has to look a bit more polished than that. Um, anyway, I've got work to go to today and then tonight I'm going out for dinner with my friends, so I probably will have to leave it for now and I'll see you tomorrow. Hey guys, it's day four um, and I have to say that today is probably my favourite outfit so far. Today dad put me in this purple floral dress that I got from a golden tote, a pearl statement necklace, some black tights, black boots and my windowpane grid patterned white bag. Uh, I did have a bit of a wardrobe issue though. The necklace that my dad chose for me to wear with this outfit is actually broken. I've swapped out that necklace for one that is kind of similar. Hoping that this is close enough for dad's vision. <laughs> I am really quite liking this combo, so well done dad. <laughs> this is definitely something that I would wear. I feel completely like me in it. It doesn't feel like a challenge at all. This is exactly something that I would wear, so thumbs up. <laughs> I think the biggest difference to how I would style myself is that dad would only ever do one piece of jewellery and I always wear earrings like even if they're tiny little stud earrings I always would pair earrings with this outfit and like with with any outfit pretty much I would always wear earrings so it's kind of weird not to have anything else but the necklace but it's not a bad thing I mean I think dad's just taking the simplistic approach all the pieces have done pretty well, except for maybe on Tuesday, um, that necklace didn't really go with the neckline. And even this neckline, like, it sits a little bit strangely on the neckline. This one's longer than the one Dad chose, but this is meant to, um, clip up. I unclipped it because I thought it looked a little strange. It looks a little bit better with more neckline to have more, um, necklace. <laughs> Dad's done pretty well, I think, for never having worn jewellery in his life. He's done pretty well. <laughs> I've got dancing tonight, so I won't be able to check in tonight, but I will see you tomorrow.
Good morning guys, it's day five. Uh, I've just gotten dressed this morning and i um, just got one final touch to put on and it's this hat. <laughs> Dad went all out with the accessories this morning. Not only do I have a necklace, I also have earrings as well as the hat. <laughs> this is a pretty good outfit. I can't complain too much. I mean, the only thing is, again, with the neckline, the necklace doesn't really go with it. I'm not sure whether I should wear it over the top or underneath. Other than all of the accessories, my dad's put this maroon crisscross neckline t-shirt over the top of a black singlet. I've never worn it over the top of anything before and it only just peeks through there. I'm not really sure what my dad had in mind with that, but I mean, it's okay. And then I have black jeans on the bottom, black ballet flats, and my windowpane grid pattern bag again. And I am noticing that my dad likes black shoes. Like, every day so far, he has put me in black shoes. I'm wondering, like, if that's kind of because that's all that he has. Like, he generally just has, like, neutral coloured black and brown shoes so that's what he's put me in. Pretty happy so far. You're not too bad with it, just the necklace issue but he seems to like this necklace. It's funny and I don't ever really wear it though so <laughs> it's getting like a bigger workout this week than it ever has I think. So it's nice to like wear pieces that I wouldn't normally. So yeah I'm off to work again. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Uh, today dad's got me in my black band t-shirt, some green skinny jeans, this straw hat, some brown oxford dress shoes, and a tan brown fringe handbag. Um, I've got to say it's something about it that's not quite sitting quite right for me, I'm not exactly sure what it is. It's not something that I would pair together, I feel a little bit foreign to myself uh, but it's okay I mean it's better than day two <laughs> um, I find it interesting though that today is actually St. Paddy's Day and I don't really have all that much green in my wardrobe but somehow dad has managed to put me in green for St. Paddy's Day I don't think he was even aware he was doing it but it's just sort of happened that way um, this outfit is for a casual Saturday except I'm going out to a cooking class with my mum this morning, so my only requirement was that I had closed in shoes because it was required of the class. And this is what he's put me in. It's interesting, it's not what I would have chosen at all for a cooking class, but it's fine, like there's nothing wrong with it. Um, and I find it interesting to note, like, apart from the hat, there are like no other accessories or jewellery. Like, um, but yeah, it's, it's an okay outfit. <laughs> Hey, so it's the last day and I totally forgot to do like a video diary this morning. So I've just gotten home from work and it's about like 6.30 and I've just spent the whole day in my last outfit that my dad picked out for me and you know, I can't complain. It's all pretty good. It goes together. I don't feel weird. Uh, the only thing I probably would have done differently, I probably wouldn't have put myself in heels on a Sunday because it's pretty casual at work on weekend days. But it's no big issue. I think Dad did a pretty good job overall with all, all of the clothing in the past week. Pablo Shush! That's the cat that lives uh, behind us. He likes to come visiting. He's very friendly. I'm pretty sure he's in love with Cleo, our cat but Cleo wants nothing to do with him. Uh, so he just meows at the door constantly. <laughs> but he's a cutie. He's gotten fat though. I have a feeling that he uh, gets fed in many places. So I'm gonna leave it there for just day seven. Hey guys, so overall thoughts on the week of wearing the outfit my dad picked out for me. Uh, I would say overall the outfits were not bad, except for that one on Tuesday. <laughs> if 
funny story about that actually because like I was watching back the footage and in the intro my dad said he would not put me in pajama pants and a top and he kind of did on Tuesday because after we'd filmed the intro and he picked out all the outfits I got changed to go to sleep that night and I was wearing those pants and a t-shirt so while I wouldn't necessarily class them as pajama pants uh, I do wear them outside like in public as well but he kind of put me in pajama pants to go to work in my observations about his style for me and the way he put the outfits together was that he did have quite a classic understated look about the outfits that he put together <laughs> i did notice that every outfit he put me in he paired it with black shoes so were black flats black sneakers black heels but they were mostly black, except for that one day when I had brown oxfords on. But overall, all neutral coloured shoes, which I think is a crossover from menswear and what's in his wardrobe, because I would say he does not have any coloured shoes. So I felt like he probably felt the most safe pairing my outfits with neutral coloured shoes. The other observation overall I had was that he only ever really put me in one piece of jewellery which is a lot like less than I would normally wear like if he put me in a necklace he wouldn't give me anything else and I would have no earrings on and I would feel like kind of naked without earrings because I always wear earrings but I think that's you know partly because he's a man as well he's obviously not used to wearing jewelry so he's probably like better safe than sorry let's just just do as much as I have to just do a little bit and he, he gave it a good try styling the jewelry but he did have a little bit of problem with the necklaces and the necklines of my shirts. There was about three occasions where they didn't really go together. Like, considering that he has never really styled a woman before, I think he has a bit of a say in what my mum wears. I think she asks his opinion on what she wears a lot of the time. But I don't think he's ever completely styled an outfit for her, let alone a week's worth of outfits. So I think he did a really good job. Thanks dad for um, being a good sport and participating in my video. Um, I hope you guys all enjoyed it and uh, yeah, found some entertainment in it. Um, I'm going to be doing another video like this with my mum styling my outfits this time which will be coming really really soon. So subscribe if you're interested in that and are enjoying the videos and give this one a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it. Uh, I'll see you next time. <laughs> see ya.